Yo guys, it's Big Granny here. Welcome back to another video of Doge Tycoon. So let's go ahead and get started. So we just bought uh, the Galaxy Researcher. So we're going to go ahead and get the cells now. Alright, so this is 90k. The next one's going to be 100, 110k, and 120k. How much money does this make? 300. So yeah, that's pretty good. I probably should have went with this first, honestly. Uh, probably would have made us money quicker, honestly. But oh well. Alright. Yeah, we're definitely making lots more money. Look at that. We're making about 2k a second. A little bit more. That's about it. Alright, so this whole thing right here is pretty much equivalent to one of those. Alright. Sweet. Oh, they're like little, a little bit different of colors. A little bit here and there. Alright. That's cool. Alright. I do like uh, the variety of uh, textures and hats that they drop too. That's, that's kind of cool how they did that. This Doge Tycoon. I mean... Would I recommend this Tycoon? Yeah, I'd probably give it a 7 or maybe a 7.5. Um, actually, you know what? I'll probably even bump it up to an 8. Um, but just because this Tycoon moves at a good pace, it looks good, it runs pretty well. Um, I don't really see it using free models at all. I mean, they're it, it is Zednov's Tycoon kit, but everybody uses that. Um, even I'm going to use that for my Tycoon. Which, a lot of people are asking me about that. I just haven't worked on it. I know. Disappointing me, right? But, it's, it's got a really nice map. I like it. Uh, there's some sword fighting if you want to do that. So, that's cool. There's also gears you can get. Which, did, I don't think the gears are too expensive. So, it, it's not one of those tycoons that make you wait. Also, I found, I like the, you, uh, like all the variety of droppers and stuff like that. Uh, with the cells. The conveyors are a little bit lacking. But, that's okay. Um... In terms of building with the Tycoon, it's it's pretty average, I would say. It looks nice, so I like all the materials they used. Uh, let's not get a uh, wood reviewer here, though. <laughs> oh, man. Love that dude. So, what? how does wood reviewer feel about this wood grain? I think the wood grain is actually fine. Could be wrong. Looks good to me. Alright. Let's check out the tree's wood grain, though. Maybe they're a different texture. Oh yeah, look look at that, that look at that tree wood grain. Oh man. Who is actually wood reviewer? If you know who wood reviewer is, let me know in the comments. I've been wondering for a while who that is. I don't think he's ever revealed himself, but um it could be just a giant joke too with Roblox, but I don't know. Ever since Discord came out with that new call function, people have been trying to spam call me. I don't really appreciate that, so I had to disable it, but... It's a really nice feature, though. Discord is doing amazing. I'm also going to try to partner with Discord, which I'm actually waiting for them to reply. I also tried verifying on YouTube. Uh, they declined. Uh, they said I need at least 100k subs, so I'm going to try to do it again. Uh, I believe it's HD, which uh, he recently got verified. Congratulations to him. A couple days ago, he hit 100,000 subscribers. You know, go show him some love and support, and he's a cool guy. Um, uh, some people don't really appreciate it that I'm growing this fast, especially since I just do gameplays, you know, whatever. I mean, I always tell people, too, if you really want to get big, then do what gets views. I'm not saying, like, make clickbait and crap, which some people actually do, and I don't really like that, but, um, you know, it's kind of a balance be between making a good reputation for yourself and also just going all out and, like, trying to be desperate for views. Alright. So I could get that other research over there, but we're just going to go ahead and finish this up so we can make pretty good money. And we'll get the rain Rainbow Doge up researcher next. Alright. I think we're making about 3k a second? Yeah, it's about 3k a second. That's pretty darn good. Man. Money has gone up really fast. Alright. So you have the Crimson Doge Laboratory, Cyan Doge Laboratory, Golden Doge Laboratory, and Mint Doge Laboratory. Also, I've heard people say, like, uh, Doge or Dog... Like, Doge or Doge or... I call it Doge. So don't mind me if you get a little bit triggered from the pronunciation. <laughs> Alright. Oh, man. The word triggered is so popular now, it's honestly really funny though, because when people get butt hurt, they're just like, oh, you're triggered. Yep. It's triggering me. I'm triggered. Alright. Let's stop with that. So we're gonna go ahead and, uh, continue. Okay, this is... 
This is concerning me, because I just keep walking by, and I keep just finding this doe just laying there. I feel like he's going to get up and come and attack me. There's also, like, this doe... Whoa. This dude's scary. I put his... Hold on, what is, what is this dude's face? Is it the same thing? Aw, oh, can I look at his face? Darn it, I thought I could, like, look through his face, or his hat, I mean. Look at his face. That was scary, though. I'm a little bit creeped out. All right. Snow Doge. So it's 800, 850. Wait, 700, 800, 900, and 1,000 for this. So this whole thing is making... Holy smokes. It's making, um... I believe 30... Wait, hold on. <laughs> trying to do math problems in my head again. Don't mind me. It's making... Making 3,400, I believe. Holy crap! About 3,400 a second. That's pretty darn good. So if you don't know my taking strategy, by the way, I always go for what makes money first. I do cosmetics a little bit here and there, but I try to put my main focus on making money. Whoa! Uh, <laughs> I have a giant rainbow attached to my head now. I guess I guess this, this makes you look beautiful, right? I'm a I'm a beautiful granny. Which a lot of people wonder, why did you name yourself Big Granny? It's weird, or... Usually they'll say that, they just ask, and I'm just like... I don't know, man, I was like 10 years old when I made it. <laughs> no, you know, a kid's mind is pretty creative, you know what I'm saying? But I, I seriously thought it, it was, like, funny for some reason. I was like, yeah, let, let's name my character Big Granny. And, uh... I made my account back in 2008, which a lot of people don't believe I'm that long of a veteran. Even though my ID is like 965,000 something or something like that. I joined before there was a million players in Roblox. Now it's growing towards 200 million. And I remember what the old Roblox is like. So if you want to question me, you can. <laughs> Most of you, a lot of my places were created in like 2010 and 2011 just because that's when I got like BC and stuff. But and here's the thing. When I joined Roblox, I was like, whoa, what is this? And it was, I thought it was amazing. Believe it or not, I actually played started playing Minecraft like two years ago, and then I quit after a couple months. I didn't really find it fun anymore. Man, the Minecraft stereotypes are really big nowadays. <laughs> the whole argument about like Roblox versus Minecraft. I remember that was big when I joined Roblox. All these people were like, "Oh, Roblox ripped off Minecraft, or Minecraft ripped off Roblox." I'm just, I'm just like, what is that supposed to even mean? Like, they're two different games. I don't understand. And people apparently think they're the same because they have blocks and they both you both build it both of them. And there's like ten thousand other games out there that have blocks or you can build in them. So aren't you gonna say that like they could be copies of Roblox too? I mean I think Roblox actually came out before Minecraft did. Not that that really matters, but Man, it's just like why? It's like it's like trying to compare Battlefield to like um, uh, what, what would be a good comparison? It's like c trying to compare Battlefield to like Dirt Rally or something. One's a racing game and one's a shooter. Oh, the, one of them's a copy of another one. <laughs> All right, I really don't understand the whole argument, and I, it's still going on, and it bugs me. I think I'm a little bit triggered right now, guys. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we're making pretty good money. I think every time I come down there, it's another 50k in our pocket. Doge producer. Man, look at look at that. Look at that rainbow. Honestly, this rainbow is kind of bugging me now. This is like a giant rainbow stuck in my head. So don't walk on those unless if you want a giant rainbow stuck to your head. Alrighty. Saved up a bit of money now. Let's go ahead and get... Whoa, almost accidentally bought that stuff. Alright, rainbow doge producer. Boom. Alright. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and finish up this stuff right here. Whoa, bunch of stuff. It's pretty expensive as you go on. <laughs> Look, the packages are still rendering. I've had people like straight up co like come at me in my comments. They're like, "Oh, your computer sucks because you're lagging on this Roblox game, whatever." But like, anytime I lag on a Roblox game, all my comp all my friends with fairly good computers or even low end computers start lagging too, and you can run Roblox on literally a toaster. If you can't run Roblox, and either you don't have a graphics card, which is pretty sad. I mean, most pre-builds don't, but... And I actually created a new Tech Talk channel. 
or yeah, voice or text channel in my Discord to talk about tech and stuff like that, because that's, that's something I'm a little bit nerdy about. <laughs> Not one of those people that like sit there and harass people that their computer sucks. I mean, I don't like those people either, but you know, the whole PC master race is a is a pretty good thing. I always tell people that too. All right, I'm just like every time I play a PC game, you know, I'm just enjoying the graphics and stuff. I'm just like, imagine how crappy this looks on console. I mean, most people can't really notice too much of a difference, but if you really look at it. You play it on the PC for yourself, you're gonna be like, whoa, get higher frame rates, higher resolution, uh, way better graphics, a better performance. I mean, you got more freedom on computers too. And everybody's always like, oh, custom builds cost like thousands of dollars. It's not like that nowadays anymore. You can literally build like a nice PC for like 500, 700 bucks. I recommend going for around the $1,000 range, but. Um, you, if you if you have a good nice balanced build, you can literally like build a really nice PC for like five hundred to seven hundred dollars. Like almost max out or max out every modern title there is. You know, now go obsolete for many years to come. I mean, I use my own processor and motherboard and RAM for over seven years and it still works. While with like pre builds most of them die in a year or two. Some of them are actually like pretty decent in terms of reliability, but for the most part, they aren't. I always talk about this in my videos too, and people get triggered from it. <laughs> I actually kind of like those YouTubers that purposely like do something in their videos to piss off people. <laughs> I don't know why. It's just, it's just funny. Like this this one YouTuber, he like did a like since all of his uh, fans are kids, he like did a really bad Minecraft video. And he like makes fun of Minecraft, and like all these people are really triggered in his comments. All right. Purchase one. Ah, we don't have enough money. Yeah, we should finish this up. It'll take a bit to save up one million, of course, but I think we're almost done with this game. I'm not gonna make another episode, so sorry for making this a little bit longer. But if I make another one, it'll only be like two minutes long, so I'm not gonna bother with that. I want to see if I can go inside this Doge head. Oh, nope. Surprised nobody adds like Easter eggs to the map. Oh, you can see how they kind of built it right here. Whoa. Roblox is really slow at rendering lights and stuff. Even at 10 graphics, they still do it from a certain range. I never really noticed a pond. I don't know why. Hmm. And the water's pretty deep. Don't want to drown. It's like, uh, more transparent as it goes up. Alright. Doge Research Tycoon. Got like a cute little baby doge right there. Ah! Alright. Dead beam tycoon, I love that. <laughs> Alright, lights 110k. Just need to collect our money. Using a rainbow carpet to get by faster. Alright. I mean, a lot of people always complain that I don't really edit my videos much. I do still do lots of cuts and stuff like that. But I just feel like it's it's just unnecessary and it takes really long to edit, so I just try to get as much videos as out as I can. I mean I have way too many videos to upload. Like, I have, like, 40 Dead Space 3 uh, <laughs> episodes to upload because we beat the whole game in, a, in, like, two nights, so. Um, so we got the Legendary Doge to buy, and then we should be able, we should be finished with this. I hope I don't miss any buttons. I mean, you got the Game Pass stuff down there, but I'm not going to bother wasting my money. I mean, I already paid for a VIP server, and I have, like, no Robux, so. Let me just show you how many Robux I have right now. <laughs> Need 76 more Robux to purchase this. Let me check how many I have right now, actually. I have, let's see, refreshing, okay, I have 74 Robux, see, I'm poor, <laughs> I have like 170 in my uh, group right now, I uh, put a lot of it into advertisements and stuff like that, alright, so we're just waiting on that legendary doge, stuff like that, everybody always asks me on my videos, like, what do you use to record, what do you use to, how do you play with friends, how do you do this, it's like, I don't know, but uh, I use action. I mean, I put all of my, st I put like, like 90% of people's questions like in the description. Well, not like the actual questions, but like the answers to them. I mean, I don't, I don't think people like read descriptions anymore. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, people do the same thing on Roblox. Like they'll put like all these things in the description, and then uh, people are all these, all these people are asking questions. It's like, do not read. 
Or they'll have like some kind of disclaimer in this description and people are like, oh, this game sucks. Or this game needs this and that or whatever. And it's like in alpha or whatever. <laughs> that's why, um... That's why most game developers make their stuff like tree lands. They make their stuff early access so you don't have like thousands of these random noobs just complaining about your game and like telling you to do a lot of stuff. I mean, it's good to have a restricted testing fan base. Because if you have too many people, it's going to get way overall and need to fix stuff. And plus, like, if you have a couple hundred people have tested the game, I think that's plenty. So, Train Lines gets hundreds of players per day, though. I need to record more of that. Not tonight, though. I'm going to probably go back to bed. We almost got that legendary doge. Alrighty. We got a million dollars now. Hopefully, this is actually a million dollars. Whoa. Wow, much brick. Shut hatch. Wow. Loading doge made by DevProm Inc. Oh, you turn into a doge when you step on it. <laughs> That's kind of a cool endgame object. I actually kind of like that. Alright. I think we officially finished this tight you guys. So don't forget to subscribe and like this video, some comments. I'm going to double check down here make sure there's nothing else to buy. But that was pretty solid tight you. We finished it in just under an hour, so... I'll see you guys later. I always get these comments, too, with people like, Oh, I finished this and that tight in like five minutes, or... I got 10 million, I got like 10 quadrillion cash on this game. <laughs> I'm level 999 on this game. I, I'm, I'm like, I'm not kidding you guys. There's, there's people that like tell me that all the time, which I believe it sometimes when they're like, oh, I beat this in under an hour, or I beat this in like two days, whatever. But like, some people are literally like, oh, five minutes, oh, I got this level, level in the game, whatever, but... Anyways, enough complaining about things. I apologize for doing that in this series. It's just, it's just a tycoon. I, like, talk about the most random crap. Because, you know, it's it's a tycoon. There's not really much to talk about, including of what the game actually does. Or I'm just really I'm just really bad at YouTube, guys. Don't don't subscribe. Alright. Risk kidding. You should subscribe. If you, if you feel I'm good. You know, that maybe not I'm good. I don't know. Okay. So... Make sure uh, to check out this tycoon, guys. I would recommend it. And like this video, leave some comments. Sorry for ranting on. I'll see you guys later. Man, it's almost 18 minutes. I'm stupid.